Hello there, guys, and welcome back to a vlog podcast thingy, uh, whatever you want to call it. I honestly do not know. Anyway, today I'm going to talk about what, like, why music is important for our education. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because schools are... They've been experiencing, at least in my area, I don't know about you, but they're experiencing a lot of budget cuts, and my school, we're lucky enough to have band every day, but in most schools, it's not going so well. So, I'm hopefully going to somehow help save it, and I'll need your help to listen to this video, think of the reasons, and hopefully convince you. First off, for those of you that don't know, I play a trumpet because I can grab a trumpet out of nowhere. This over there. Over there. There's no nothing over here. Anyway, yes, this is my trumpet. It's a beautiful trumpet, isn't it? Say hello to the trumpet. It says hi back in case he said hi. No. So yes, I do not sing in case you're wondering. I'm a bad singer. I do not have this mic for singing, this mic is for recording. Okay, so, let's get started. One reason that is good for, music is good because, well, we can't live without it. Because people are always like, oh yeah, I can't live without music, I listen to it all the time. Let's pretend music did not, like, they didn't have it in schools. It would be hard to learn. Yeah, like, yes, you can get private lessons, but I like school better because you can, you can hang out with your friends, you can vote, you can play together. But, see, if they took it out of schools, then basically there would be no music that is American, our music interest industry would go down and we'd all get bored to death because there'd be no music. What a terrible world. <laughs> so, that is a very good reason. I listen to music all the time. I like, well, a lot of music. Another good reason is that it's teachers always saying you need to pick a good career. Music is probably a one of the best careers ever. Because it's not like too hard. It can be very well paying if you're good. Like all those famous artists out there, they are they all earn their money from music. They don't house. They don't work in like a factory or some other job. They you won't just like go to McDonald's and be like, oh yeah, look, it's Justin Bieber right there. I'd like a McDouble. Yeah. That, that'd be pretty cool if you could find celebrities at McDonald's. And another good reason is that it is a mix of both subjects. Like, reading and language is a big one because, see, this right here is music. Not no music. Oops. Not no music, you cannot read this. Because, well, music is good for... Uh, reading because it helps you read music. In case you're wondering, this is Colliding Visions by Brian Balmagus. Balmages, Magus, Mages, whatever it is. There's a lot of stuff people can pronounce. And it is a mix of a bunch of other stuff, like history for one, because when you learn about different like artists that are from a long time ago like Mozart and yeah it's also a form of art because when most people say or when they think art they think like painting Picasso all that stuff <clears throat> music is an art as a matter of fact just like dancing and photography all that stuff. It is a very good art and it's very entertaining and fun to listen to slash play. 
Another good reason is that it's uh, here. It uses both sides of the brain. Here, I have an article. Here, I have an article on this website. I will I will link some websites down there in the description to uh, that have some information. You can also just Google some up if you want more information. Anyway, here's an article from this one. Um. From this one website. Music participa participation provides a unique opportunity for literacy preparation. Whether the children are, are singing, playing, or listening, teachers direct them to listen and hear in new ways which exercise oral discrimination. Playing instruments and adding movement to the lessons teaches children about the sequential learning which, which is essential to reading comprehension. Plata once said that music is a more potent instrument than any other for education. You will find many teachers of young children who will agree with him. Recent research found that music uses both sides of the brain, which is one thing I wanted to mention. And the fact that makes it valuable in all areas of development. Music affects the growth of a child's brain academically, emotionally, physically, and spiritually. So, those are all good stuff. I kind of want to be smart. I don't know about you. So, it does use both sides of the brain. Let's see, here. Here's another thing on that. For some people, the primary primary reason for providing music lessons the primary reason for providing music lessons to their children or this is which is academic a recent study from the University of California found that music trains the brain for higher forms of thinking a sec second graders who were given music lessons scored 27 percent higher on proportional math and fraction tests than children who received no special instruction Research indicates that music training per permanently wires a young mind for enhanced performance. So that again proves that music is good for the brain. Um, okay, another thing is that it is physical. Some people agree because you're just sitting there playing the drum gun. Da -da 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 wrong because you need to blow out air, breathe in air, and then singing it kind of warms up your throat. So it is it is very it's pretty physical, says I hear. Music can be described as a sport. Learning to sing and keep rhythm and develops co coordination. The air wood air and wind power is is necessary to blow a flute, trumpet or saxophone promotes a healthy body. So right there proves that music is good for your health. It's also kind of emotional depending on what kind of music you're listening to. And is another good way of expressing. Another thing right here says that you can studies show that students that learn music get better SAT scores. Students who have experience with music performance or or appreciation score higher on SAT. One report indicates 63 points higher on verbal and 44% higher on math for students that in for music ap application courses. So again, it's good for the brain. Good old brain right there. Still there, buddy? Good. I kind of need my brain. He's he's my best friend. Another thing is that music can be relaxing. Students can fight stress by learning to play music. Soothing music is especially helpful for helping kids relax. So there's another benefit for music. What else? Better self confidence. With encouragement from teachers and parents, students playing a musical instrument can can pride and confidence. Musical education is also likely to de develop better communication for students. Like I said about the language and all that, it's, it's a lot of the same thing. 
Kids stay engaged in school. An enjoyment, an enjoyable subject like music can help keep keep kids into interested and engaged in school. Few musicians are likely to to stay in school to achieve other subjects. And that's a very good reason for school. It can help make you smarter, get better grades, make your parents happy. If you're not in school, if you have kids that go to school, you can be happy about your kids' grades. So that's another good reason. What else? Kids can learn teamwork. Many musical education programs require teamwork as a part of a band or orchestra. In these groups, students will learn how to work together and build a camaraderie. Um, I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm reading these off one of the websites. I will link in the description, so you will you can tell me if I pronounce it right or not in the comics or the comments. Yay! But yes, it is really good for teamwork because, like, say you're playing a beautiful piece, one guy is off a beat. He will throw everyone off the beat, therefore being it, because he wasn't good for the team. If everyone's like being a good team and working together, the piece will sound beautiful. Just like lots of pieces. It can also... Students can learn better pattern recognition. Learn pattern recognition. Children can develop their math and pattern recognition skills with the help of musical education. Playing music offers repetition and fun format. So again, it can help patterns. Very fun. Another thing is that if you're bored, sometimes what I'll do is I'll get out my trumpet. I'll just either play a song, Google up some sheet music. It could, yeah, just and just play it. It's it's very entertaining. I honestly think they should add in the schools because yeah, it's just very important in every way it's in the video. Now I hope I've convinced you all the good reasons. So that's all the reasons I have for now. If you want, you can look up some more. And I hope you've enjoyed this video, so I'll see y'all later.